put it on the wrist. I gotta put a little hole in here. I'm gonna put it on the wrist of this mirror part. Then I'm going to uh, do this back end where the generator used to be. Take out the, um, the sliders because we're gonna use that on the other side for the for the gray tank. Today, uh, I'm now, I am now at a standstill with the RV again. Um, the reason is the weather, I guess you could say. Um, it's starting to become, it's starting to stay windy and I can't weld because of that. At the end of the month, when I get paid, I'll be buying a garage that will go over the RV so I can enclose it for the winter time. It's not the exact size for it, so the back end is going to stick out a little bit, but it's close enough. <laughs> I'm not too worried about that. But once I can get that garage, um, it'll be more enclosed because it'll have sides and everything. And it'll block the wind so that way I can start welding the, the rest of the frame and start putting it on the floor so I can start building the frame. So next month, November, it's really gonna start building up.
Big shout out to my cousin Clay for coming down to help me put up the ends and the sides today. I was so happy because <laughs> if I had to get up on that ladder myself, I would have most likely fallen off. 